just two Quran ayats. Proof contradiction in the Quran. Surah Mujadila, Ayah 2, and Surah Azab, Ayah 6. Surah Azab, Ayah 6, his wives are their mothers, meaning the Prophet's wives are the believer's mothers. Then in Surah Mujadila, verse 2, we are told, or it's stated that uh, by pronouncing their wives uh, as their mothers, when separating, uh, it is an objectionable statement and a falsehood because it says here, their mothers are none but those who gave birth to them. So although Allah is pardoning and forgiving, however, uh, the statement here is an objectionable statement and a falsehood. So just by stating, noteworthy, just by stating that your wives are now your mothers when divorcing them or separating from them, the Quran ayat Surah Mujadila 2 says it is an objectionable statement and a falsehood or a lie. They tell. So then in Surah Azab verse 6 we see that Allah has declared the Prophet's wife, wives as the believer's mothers. And this is also a declaration, a statement, uh, which should be false and uh, objectionable statement, according to Surah Mujadila, Ayat 2, as you can see both of the ayats here. Moreover, note of seers on Ayah 6 of Surah Azab on how the wives of the Prophet, being mothers of the believers, should be taken would clarify the position of Surah Mujadila, Ayah 2, since it states that even calling anyone your mothers is an objectionable statement and a lie on the grounds that your mothers are only those who gave you birth. Hope I've made this uh, very, very clear for you. Then coming to Surah Nisa, Ayat 82, it says, then do they not reflect upon the Qur'an? If it had been from any other than Allah, they would have found within it much contradiction. So we found the contradiction in Surah Azab, Ayat 6, and Mujadil Ayat 2. That's with the uh, two ayats uh, I showed you earlier, Surah Azab, Ayat 6, and Mujadil Ayat 2. And this ayat, Surah Nisa 82, we can safely say that this Qur'an is from other than Allah. Various translations of Surah 51, ayat 10. Destroyed are the falsifiers. Woe to the falsehood mongers. Doomed are the conjecturers. Cursed be the liars. Accursed be the conjecturers. Slain are the constant conjecturers. 